Man, it sure feels good to be out on the bike. It's been about a week, and I know some of you wanting to reach through your YouTube and punch me in the face. Just happened to take the back way. It's been a couple of... Uh, Three rough weeks at work, we've been extremely busy. One of those essential businesses that everybody shop in. Boy, look at how pretty that looks. But I got a job, I'm happy. None of my associates are losing their jobs, so everybody's working. So I can't complain too much. Work for a good company. Uh, today, I'm just out on the bike. Like I said, I just left the store, headed home. Thought I would take the long way around and at the time to see what you all were up to as well. Unfortunately, I had to cancel the Ozark Escape. Had to pull the plug on it a couple of weeks ago and uh, that would have been happening next weekend. But uh, Missouri has issued a stay at home that started this Monday and a lot of states have uh, issued them as well. Arkansas, believe it or not, still does not have a stay at home. Uh, their governor is fighting it very, very hard. Uh, we will see how that plays out. We are limiting, and when I say we, the state of Arkansas is limiting who uh, travels in between states. So I don't know how they're doing that. I've never seen anybody stopping me or asking me when I'm coming from Missouri to Arkansas. Uh, but look at that cool almost want to go underneath that. Um, but I've never had anybody asking me, uh, so I don't know how they're monitoring that or whatever. Um, maybe they're doing it more towards the borders of Oklahoma and Texas, but I don't know. So, But today I just thought I'd get you out on the bike a little bit. I know some of you haven't been able to get out for a while. Uh, again, folks, I understand the concerns about safety on a motorcycle and, and we should be staying at home. But again, I'm commuting back and forth to work. That is all I'm doing. And again, if you don't agree with me riding a motorcycle, I can appreciate that. Uh, but I got to either drive or ride. So I decided to drive. I mean, ride. So um, again, I can appreciate where you come from. But it's a personal decision, and I have decided to commute a couple days a week on the motorcycle. I will say that it's given me a little bit of a, an emotional break. It's been kind of tough, like I said, at work the last couple of years. I mean, years. It's felt like years. Uh, the last couple of weeks. Uh, but getting on the bike a little bit has been kind of nice and let me take my mind off some of it. So... It's been kind of good. So now I'm going to get ready to get on one of my favorite stretches of road, Missouri 90. This takes it outside of Knoll. That's where I'm catching it now. And that'll run me all the way over almost to the house where I drop down and uh, just jump onto the house. The Elk River looks like it's running pretty good. Haven't had a lot of rain, but looks like it's at least running pretty good. I think I'll probably stop and take some pictures somewhere down here. Not sure where. This new windscreen, if y'all can see it in the front, is a tinted windscreen. And um, from V-Stream, looks really badass, I think. Uh, but uh, it also works very well. It's a little smaller, it's not as wide, and it's not as tall. But it does a great job at uh, keeping the wind off of you and doing what it's supposed to do. There's some people down there that are trying to do some social distancing. So, uh, and then everybody's trying to get out on the water a little bit. It's 86 degrees here today. It's uh, beautiful. So it's just, uh, I think everybody's just trying to take the advantage of getting on it, uh, getting out and getting some relaxation, get some vitamin C. Tomorrow, believe it or not, we're supposed to drop 30 degrees. Uh, it's supposed to be much colder over the next three or four days and temperatures on the weekend are down in the mid 30s overnight so i'm going to enjoy this while we can it's been kind of crazy because we've seen a lot of motorcycles on the road 
And uh, again, Arkansas is not a stay-at-home state, so uh, people have been getting out on the weekends. They have been doing the social distancing thing, which has worked out pretty well. Uh, I have noticed everybody's been keeping apart from each other and all that, but uh, again, Arkansas doesn't have a stay at home, so a lot more people out on the road. Um, what's kind of funny, or just an observation, is my store's in Joplin, Missouri, and they do have a stay at home, and my store's as busy as it's ever been. So um, I think people that have the stay at home, they've decided that the hardware store is a place to go and hang out. So uh, again, I'm not complaining. Uh, they're keeping us employed, but uh, again, if it was me, I don't know if I'd be hanging out in a store with 80 other people if I could avoid it, but it's all good. Man, it sure feels good to be out on the bike. It's been about a week, and I know some of you wanting to reach through your YouTube and punch me in the face because you probably haven't got the ride in weeks. So for that, I do apologize, but it is, uh, I will say it, it is great to be out on the bike. Until then, I think I'm just going to take a quick little jaunt here and shut up and just let you all enjoy the ride. love that this is right around the corner from the house. I can take it just on my daily commute. So I'm really thinking about getting a drone. The DJ Mini Mavic. Been kind of looking at that. I don't want anything crazy, but I would like to be able to have a have a drone to be able to throw up every once in a while, especially a small one that's easy to carry. So tell me if you guys think that's a good idea or not. Maybe it's just a waste of 600 bucks, who knows. If anybody's got a Mini and they have any thoughts about it, I'd love to hear about it. Everything's starting to turn green again, which is really nice. Two to three weeks, it'll be beautiful to be riding through here. It's not so bad now. Well, we're back on my other favorite stretch of 90. So I thought I'd bring you back on here and kind of talk about some things. It's really been kind of the bummer about the world situation now. One of the bummers, right? There's a lot of things going on. But one of the bummers for us people who like to ride motorcycles are how many events are being shut down for the summer. Uh, already moving a bunch, of, a bunch of things around. I've had to shut down the ride we were gonna have. I'm hoping we have vacation planned in June. I'm hoping that's not gonna be impacted, but as things are going right now, it might. I know that the Star Rally, the MSTA Star Rally in Cape Girardeau, Missouri, it's been pushed back to September. It just seems that a lot of the events are being pushed back and for good reason, but it uh, doesn't make it suck any worse or less. Jamie and I are gonna be doing a video uh, had a couple questions, uh, people asking us questions, so we thought about doing a Q&A video. So if you have any questions that you have for me or Jamie about motorcycles or, you know, just about almost anything, uh, just shoot us a... 
that lady was way over the line and uh, and we can uh, we'll try to answer your questions in the next video if you have any uh, anything you want to know about us just uh, put them in the comments below and we'll uh, we'll address them in the video if you friends with us on Facebook or Instagram any of that you can also ask the questions on there I'll put the links to those uh, sites in here as well if this doesn't relax you on your commute home, nothing will. I want to say thank you to everybody who uh, watched the 5,000, I mean the 10,000 mile video for the Versus. It's actually my most watched video now, so I really appreciate that. It's going to have almost 700 views, maybe even more, so that's a record for us. I got a new mic for the GoPro. So I'm actually going to try that on the front of the helmet with that mic and see how that works. Uh, I'm going to test that. I may test that tomorrow. I'm off. I'm actually going to do some editing tomorrow and just kind of hang out and chill. Maybe get the Jeep out. We may go get a picnic or something. That might be kind of fun. Take the Jeep out. We haven't had the Jeep out for a while. Go do some Go find a secluded area, pack us a picnic, and have some lunch. This is the back way into our house. So as you can tell, the back way is a lot of fun. Beats the interstate. such a good stretch through there well everybody we're about to wrap this up so I hope you enjoyed today's commute thanks again for riding with us if you like what you see if you like the channel hit the button down below smash the bell all that sort of thing and uh, let us know you like what you're watching again we're gonna keep putting out content just because we like doing it but we always like to know that somebody's watching it as well so all right, everybody, until next time, enjoy your afternoon. Hope you're staying safe, stay healthy. Stay inside if they told you to stay inside. And until next time, everybody, be safe, okay?